This video will show you how to connect Google Scholar to various databases offered through the Rebecca Crown Library. It's easy to connect Google Scholar to Dominican Library resources. This gives you free full-text articles that would be expensive to access without linking to Dominican's databases. You should never pay for an article through Google Scholar. Using Google Scholar is a great place to start searching for sources if you're not too familiar with Dominican Library's online tools or databases, as it gives you a familiar layout of search results. To connect your account to the library, go to scholar.google.com and select Settings from the drop-down menu found on the top left of the screen. If you have a Google account, make sure that you're logged in to have your settings saved. If you're wanting to filter searches to only peer-reviewed articles, you're probably better off using a database from the library, as Google does not use this criteria for including articles in Scholar. From the left-hand sidebar, select Library Links. Assuming you're not on campus, you should have Open World Cat Library Search already selected. You'll also want to add a few more by simply entering Dominican University in the search bar. Select Rebecca Crown Library, Dominican University, Full Text at Dominican, Dominican University, ProQuest, Full Text, Dominican University, Illinois, ProQuest, Full Text, and you can also add Dominican University, Find It at DU. Then, click on Save. Enter your keywords in the search bar. To see the advanced search options, click on the same drop-down menu on the top left and select Advanced Search. You can narrow your search by words and phrases found in the title or anywhere in the article, author, publisher, and date. When you enter a search, you'll see links to the library resources on the right-hand side of the page. To see an article in full text, just click on the link. Most articles will open directly. To see additional articles that have cited the sources you're looking at, click on Cited By. There's also a link to see related articles. Google Scholar also gives you an easy way to cite articles. Simply click on the quotation marks icon and the citations will pop up in various styles, such as MLA, that can be copied and pasted into a bibliography. You'll want to double check the citation, as computer-generated citations sometimes have typos or incorrect formatting. Google Scholar also allows you to save and organize articles. Click on the star icon to save, and the article will be added to your library. If you want to organize your articles, go to My Library at the top right of the page. You can add labels to the articles by clicking on the box next to a source and then the label icon at the top of the page. If you have further questions about how to use Google Scholar, take a look at the help link at the bottom of the page or ask a librarian by contacting us.